welcome to a new couple of weeks. I've got a few little small announcements before we start on the sneakers. First of all, happy birthday for tomorrow. Oh, thanks, which mate. By the time this airs, will be yesterday. Cool. So for the chips, I brought back oh, one of your favourites. Oh mate, that's a very classy. <laughs> movie, that is. Let's break these open. Are you doing anything special for it? Uh, just going out for dinner, mate. Ah, uh, lunch, actually, sorry. Oh, yeah. Oh. oh, they are good. For tomato, doesn't sound very appealing, but it is. Yeah. And the second announcement is this July, I will be going dry. Oh, I'll dry July, July. July. So the link to donate will be down below. Mm. So I'm just, I'm on the waters. For the next month. So it's July by the June when this comes out. End of June. But you're yeah. starting early. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the 29th of June it'll come out, yeah. Yeah. It's dry June and July. <laughs> I'll be going a bit into August as well, just because of the way the recording sessions lay. All oh, right. But let's get stuck into the shoes, shall we? Let's go. I have 82 hours of recording left, so better man this snap. 82 <laughs> hours. <laughs> it's like over four days. Where are you even seeing that? Right down the bottom. Oh, I've got 1,462 <laughs> hours. <laughs> I don't even know how I got that to come up, because it's gone now. All right, so... First up, we have a Bodega, a New Balance X Racer All Terrain. I think as far as uh, terrain shoes go, these aren't too bad. Got a bit of cushion on the, mm. on the side there. It does look very comfortable. Like up in there, you mean? Yeah. Yeah. Got some bump. This looks like, um, you know, the gum when it's in like the pack and you have to pop oh, it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It does look like that. Yeah, yeah, I think... They look like a hiking shoe. Mm. But it's one of the more... Oh, what are they? Like, all-terrain shoes. Pleasing to look at, like, all-terrains that I've, I've seen. Mm. They're quite nice. It's not bad. Yeah, so these ones came out... When was that? Last Thursday? Yeah, last Thursday. For 140 There you go. It's pretty cheap. Not bad. Next up, we've got the Adidas Response Hover Turf. Oh. This came out last Friday. It's not good. For 160. What is this? Adidas? Yeah. For some reason I thought you said Nike. I was like, they've stolen the logo. <laughs> I hate this bit. That looks dreadful. It looks like a monster truck. It does. Well, like, um, I like diggers, how they got those wheels that just go around. Oh, I like the tank wheel. Thing. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever those are called. I don't like it. I don't like that bit that's, either. That's terrible. <laughs> Looks like a school shooter shoe. I'm coming a few different colours. No, I don't like any of them. Is there, <laughs> oh, the top, I'm just not, I don't like mesh. I think the mesh isn't doing it for me either. Yeah. I think knit is, oh, that looks like an angry face. Mm. <laughs> That's quite good, actually. I do like that part of it. Has that? it got a... Formation? Yeah. No, Formation. formation. Does it have a zipper for me money, or? <laughs> I'm judging all the shoes so. based on that now. <laughs> if it's got the zip, it's got to pass. You lose two marks for not having <laughs> a pouch. No. I don't like that. Addy Preen Plus. Okay, so they would be comfy. But yeah, no. I'm not a fan either. I don't like them one bit. They're not worth $160. No. Next shoe. It's a collab. The old tray collab. It's a rarity between Neighbourhood, Mr. Cartoon, which I've never heard of, and Vans. I do like that name, though. I do Mr. like Cartoon. it, too. So I've done the old schools and the uh, authentics. Yeah. Those authentics, I don't like the look of those. Me neither. The old schools look alright. The authentics look like someone's, like, passed away. Like... It's like street graffiti or something. Like, you know what I mean? Like I can definitely see that, yeah. Put a memorial up. And like with that writing down there, I Uncle don't... Toon. 
Uncle Toon's man, Mart. Something like male? Male. Oh, I think you might be right with male. I don't know. It just, it looks very like Dexter. You know, Jet Pilot. All those really cringy oh, brands. Like Roxy. Who are you talking about? Dexter. The Is serial it? killer. No, or that bloody <laughs> little kid. <laughs> the scientist. <laughs> <laughs> they, they just look like, you know those shirts that always come with like the half-naked ladies on them? Yeah. It looks like that. You're not wrong. They're quite... Oh, it's even got a lady. What is it? Oh, that's his neighbourhood. Wait, so... I still don't... I don't know what that would say. I don't know anything about Mr. Cartoon. Maybe it's got to do... Yeah, it does say Uncle Toon's male. No, Mart. Because it's... Oh, Mart. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Maybe it's got something to do with Mr. Cartoon. I'm I'm not vibing with these. What's the... Anonymous Mask... Really old schools. They're not, not bad. They just look like all black shoes. Yeah. If it's like, over these, I'll definitely just take the all black old schools. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm not a fan of the the writing on it at yeah, all. Yeah, the writing doesn't. Los Angeles. I don't know what the other one would say. Yeah. No. The other one said Mr. Toon's Mart again. Oh, I didn't. She's a creative. I think maybe not actually. No, it doesn't look like it does say that, actually. Uh, no, we don't really get a good look at it. All right, well, not... No, we're only 75. Yeah, I'd take the, the old schools for 75, I mean. Yeah, oh, the authentics are 75, oh. and the old schools are 95. Oh, they're 95. Yeah. A little bit sneaky. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, these ones released last Friday on the 26th. All right. I've got the... Nike Air Metal Max USA. Oh, Lord. <laughs> I haven't heard of the Air Metal before. I need to see the other side. That's fair. Oh, <laughs> they Lord, are... no. It's even worse. <laughs> they are really bad. I don't... Oh, the top just looks like... That... It makes... They look like fat feet. They do. They're max, mate. <laughs> I haven't heard of the air metal before. I don't know if it's an really existing silhouette or not. No, we don't really get that great of a photography on them either. No. Nah. <laughs> uh, this was released last Saturday for 140 No. Nah, which nah. I think for any kind of max shoe, or any kind of air shoe, I should say, is fairly standard. Oh. But these are really bad. Don't write. Um, what are these things meant to be? Air pockets. Make you go faster, mate. <laughs> Got the air holes. The speed holes. Literally. For when your feet get hot. But, <laughs> good, I need that now. It's probably freezing. It is very cold out here at the moment. Sort of Didn't getting like to like 8 degrees in the morning out here. It's been getting colder where I live. Like really? zero out there. Fucking hell. Oh, I'm freezing. jealous. I like the cold well. No. Not that cold. <laughs> you prefer the hot weather? Prefer medium weather. I, so prefer like, co- I prefer hot weather over cold weather. Ah, that's, that's wrong. <laughs> What's your ideal temperature? Oh, Twenty-three. I don't know. Oh. Is that is that ideal? What's it? Now my ideal temperature is like, like five what, degrees. What's the human temperature? Are you running about thirty-six? <laughs> oh, I don't want that. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's room temperature. Isn't room temperature like 23? Room temperature is about 22. Yeah, well then, mm. yeah. there you go. Eyes can just be neutral. Not hot, not cold. No, I like rugging up. It's a nice feeling. No, you can't move around, you're like... I think <laughs> once it reaches zero <laughs> and your nose starts to, like, hurt, that's when it's gone too far. Oh, no. You're not wrong. <laughs> Next up, this is only a Japan release. I don't know what's going on with the price here. Whether it's seventeen and a half thousand yen or eight thousand yen, it's a pretty big difference. I'll take the eight thousand. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure if they'd give you the, the choice between the two, or I genuinely don't know what's going on with that. But it is a children's release. Oh, it could be actually. Yeah, I don't know that. Yeah, up here it says kids' sizes. There you go. I don't know how much that equates to. In I'm going to say three hundred dollars. Let's have a look. Two hundred and what did I say? Thirty-seven. Three hundred. I think it said three hundred. Yeah. All right. Let's see. 
Oh lord, I like those, um... Like these ones? Yeah. Yeah. I like them both. Oh, it's got a split tongue action. Mmm. Yeah. A split tongue is very popular. Mm. So, obviously, Sean Wallerspoon sticking to his... His trot... What is it? Tried and true. Yeah. Tested. Test... I don't know. <laughs> Whatever that's yeah, saying what you're is. trying to say. <laughs> Tested is... I think it's tried and true, but I thought tested was in there somewhere too. Tried, true, and tested. Is that it? Well, I just made it up. If not... <laughs> it is now. But yeah, I actually really like them. So it's got like custom patches. I don't know if that means you could swap them out or... I was going to say it looks a bit like um, corduroy on there. Mm. And that uh, sketch there does... Say like corduroy panelling. Yes. I like um, the names as well. Bright LA Hughes and then Tokyo at Dusk. That's quite nice. Does it say Hughes? Oh, yeah, yeah. you can take the patches off. That's pretty things. cool. I like that. Oh, you've even got a little... I don't know, thing there. Whatever that <laughs> a little <is>. thing. <laughs> you get a little thing with it. You get a patch. I like... Oh, it comes with pink laces too. That's nice. You and like a little Atmos like? patch. What's that? Looks like, you know, those bonsai tree things that you got a rake with the little rake and it, like, calms you down? It does, <laughs> that's what yeah. That looks like. Maybe that's what they're going for, because surely that's, like, a Japanese thing. Is it a Japanese mm. tree? I think so. I don't know. Maybe he's gone well, for that. The sai, yeah, that definitely sounds Japanese. Oh, bonsai. Bonsai. I also like the uh, the cut here thing on the box. That's quite nice. Do you actually have a cut there? I think it would open normally. <laughs> Shouldn't have that. It's false advertising. <laughs> Someone's, Someone's going to ruin their box. <laughs> I, I like both colorways, but I like the light blue one just a little bit better. Oh, does it come with a little carry bag? Or Oh, no, that'd be extra yeah, things because they've be got shirts. On the side, yeah. I really like that, actually. Those colors are, like, work beautifully together. Oh, that's nice. The Sean Willerspoon logo in... The Atmos. Is that what that is? Mm. There you go. But there's nothing on the shirts that say ASICS unless it's just the shoes where ASICS is involved. Right. I'd say it would be. Yeah, they're quite nice. I don't like the, the Velcro there, though. I understand you need it to be able to have swappable patches. Yeah. But I feel like you know, that load of the ground is just going to get really dusty and then things won't stick to it anymore. I reckon you should have just kept the single patch. Mm. It looks good. And, like, it looks really good. Yeah, with the yellow. Oh, how soft does that look? Oh, Wait, I, I want to see the. I want to see the other one. All right. Because does it say? Yeah, it does. One says LA and one says Tokyo. Wait, whereabouts? On the, on the tongue, on the outside. Oh yeah so yeah LA yeah. LA and then yeah T Y O. Yeah. yeah, that's pretty cool. I like that. Yeah, no, I think that's a really nice. Collab, especially that they come in the kids. That's, that's a, a nice little touch. So that's only in Japan. I think so. Yeah, it mentions um, that they may be releasing releasing in LA, but mm. something's happening with Round Two. They say it's unclear considering the condition of Round Two's storefront. What is Round Two? Uh, it's a sneaker store. So I don't know if that's just due to the riots. Yeah, maybe, maybe got it's smashed up. Yeah, I, I don't know. I haven't uh, researched that at all, but uh, it looks like they were planning an LA release as well, which would make sense, the LA and the Tokyos. I don't know if you could get both at one location or just the LA's oh, at the LA's. Yeah, right. But uh, yeah, it looks like it has been postponed for now. They might just do an online Post release. <laughs> uh, but yeah, these ones released uh, Saturday, which is today for us. I wonder how the release will go. In Japan, you need a, um, I wonder if you could use a VPN. Yeah. Like, can you use this is sponsored by no, just... <laughs> now I've got another ASICS collab with GmbH no idea what that is on the Gel Nandy 360 oh lord it's very icy <laughs> lord it looks very squeaky it does but yeah it looks like nurse scrubs but it does look like it would make make noise when you walk Especially, I don't really like that the reflectiveness on that. That looks like the um we talked about them last week, the Jordan Eleven. Yeah, the Concords. I'm not a, a fan of reflective surfaces on shoes. 
I don't know. That's just a bit too much blue for me. Or teal or aqua, whatever colour that is. I yeah. suppose that's toothpaste. Aqua. It does look like toothpaste. Honestly down there it looks like the like the kids mint toothpaste. That looks like something out of Ice Age. Like that's the inside of a cave, I reckon. Oh what like if Ice Age is like um Yeah. If they've walked through a cave <laughs> but, <laughs> <laughs> that's that's, how, the that's inside how they of come it. out. <laughs> yeah, that's like the icy cave, like not the snowy cave. That's the icy cave. Yeah. Oh, where they're like seeing all like the frozen yeah. monsters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That'd be cool if you like flip over the Solons, like the monster in there. Oh, that would be cool. They should have done that. <laughs> there needs to be a um, Ice Age collab. That would be pretty pretty dope. I Who's Ice Age then. with DreamWorks? I think so. Maybe. I don't know. What toothpaste do you use? Mate, they've even got Ice Age symbols there. <laughs> As if this isn't an Ice Age <laughs> Um, Just Colgate Mint. Oh, yeah. What, That's the just basic, a standard. Yeah, standard. Uh, what about you, mate? You use special oh, ones, some, don't um, you? Yeah, some whitening. It's called like the... I don't know. Something starts with R. No. It tastes weird though. Do you feel like you need whitening toothpaste? I drink a lot of coffee, oh. so just to sort of keep them nice At and pearly. Level. Yeah. So they they get dirty, <laughs> then you clean them. Yeah. They don't get whiter. They just go back to the they original. They maintain. Thing. Yeah. <laughs> right. Um, mate, this is definitely an ice age thing here. I don't know. I think I'm onto something. You need these like triangle bits to walk in snow properly, I believe. You're not wrong. I reckon it is, and um, I don't know what these are. These are the snow ones. Yeah, the other ones are the ice. <laughs> I don't. As if the, I don't like how yellow that is there, or bronze, I suppose. It's like gold almost. You know? Yeah, it's quite uh, distracting. Yeah, not the biggest fan of these. They'll set you back 180, and they released on Saturday. Next up, we've got a collab between Kith and Vans for their slip-on. Up the Ronnie. Looks like the top of a Sistine Chapel. Mm. Back in the 18th... No. When was Michelangelo around? I'm going to oh, say... The 1300s? <laughs> no. Was he? I don't know. I'm going to what, say... What's your guess? I mean, think about this logically, right? <laughs> The first fleet came over in what, like seventeen seventy eight or whatever. Yeah, I suppose so. So I feel like he's like year, like years before. That. <laughs> I'm gonna. Oh, actually, you could be right with the thirteenth century. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say fourteen seventeen was his birthday. Fourteen seventeen. <laughs> yeah. Oh, mate, <laughs> you're pretty bang on. Less than sixty years off. There you go. Hey, what we look like? He was old as fuck when he died. He was born in a place called Michelangelo. <laughs> Surely it was named after him. I did not oh, know that's what he looked like. I actually didn't know what he looked like, to be honest. Is that him, or is that something... He, no, that's just something he, he built. Probably. It kind of looks like his hair. How do you... It looks like Abraham Lincoln. How do you do that with a sculpture? Like, that's insane. Yeah, I know. It's just with a hammer and a pick or something. Anyway, it looks like, um, like a Mandela. Is that what they're called? Like the... Uh, your... I know Mandala. it's the Mandela effect. Mandala. Mandala. Yeah. That's it, yeah. Wait, is they one pair? Yeah, I think so. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, maybe not, actually. No, they're not. No, okay. Oh, that's right, yeah. I'd probably okay. go the blue pair. They're a bit, um... They're a bit wild for me. Yeah. A bit distracting. Well, Kith does quite a few, um... Collabs with Vans, and I don't like any of them. They had one a while ago. It was, I think it was an error, and it was leopard print and incredibly furry. Like the fur would have been like that long, like that, almost an inch. That's funny though. It looked horrible. Nah, not for me. These I don't ones. like the box. Not for me, unfortunately. I agree with you on that one. Um, but the price on these ones are a hundred and forty. Oh no, sorry, that's my guess. We haven't. Oh, that's your guess. We don't have a price. Oh. But going off of what they priced their previous collabs, I would guess it's about 140 uh, But they're releasing for us today, which is why I can't tell you the price. But they're released on Saturday. There you go. 
and then at release ing, we've got the Adidas Adi Zero Adios Pro for two hundred dollars. Well, Adios. Well, there isn't a lot of Adios. They're quite. They're very sleek. They will go fast. They look like those uh, speed trains that they got in Japan. The bullet like, Yeah, the bullet trains. Uh, so you can see some... straight through the other side. Can you? Oh, I'm not sure I like... Yeah, because you can <laughs> see, like, this bit on the other side along there. Yeah. Oh, you're going to have to wear socks with that. Lord. I hate wearing those socks with shoes anyway. That's a thick sole, that is. That is. Oh, I, I like that promo shot where they've broken. What the fuck is that thing? Where is that sitting? Maybe on the bottom. That looks like a mustache. That um, those oh, one here. Soul. yeah, those two things. <laughs> I like this as well. That's really nice. Is that how they do it? I have no idea how shoes are made. I would assume so because it's all one piece. It looks very pretty. I don't rate that. Shoe. Like if Apple comes out with a shoe, I imagine it to look like how this, especially down the side there. Looks very clean. Apple need to make a shoe, I reckon. Oh, it's just in the sole. Yeah, you're right. The Light Strike Pro. <laughs> Cellar mesh. It's like celery. Energy rods. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so they got the front of the foot. Huh. Runs up with the toes. I wonder if you could feel it. Nah. I reckon it's all just bloody for show. <laughs> probably just bloody. So look how revolutionary we are. Yeah. Probably just looks like, it's probably just drawn on with Mark. <laughs> <laughs> so these ones are coming out on Tuesday, which is tomorrow, for 200 bucks. I think 200 for something that looks as cutting edge as it does. I don't know if it is cutting edge or not, mm. but it, it, it at least looks that way. I think 200 is fairly reasonable. The next up is the opening ceremony and Reebok collab on their Instapump Fury OG. This is the plaid green. I would have never have guessed. <laughs> God, the Instapumps are bad, aren't they? I like them actually. No. Nah. Right, then get that. I want a, um, a pair of their Instapump um, Fury Grinches. They were on sale for like ninety bucks one time. I almost copped, but I didn't. No. Because I, I didn't know what to wear them with. Now they're going for almost 300 Should have no. copped. Rip. No. Yeah, so these ones are releasing the 1st of July, which is Wednesday for 170 And there's a second colorway as well in the yellow plaid. Is it plaid or plaid? Plaid. Yeah, I think so too. It's just weird that it's spelt like that. Why they got an eye there? I don't mind them. But I don't like how reflective they are. I think if it didn't have the shine to it, mm. it would be a lot better. Those aren't bad. Mm. And next up, we've got the Nike Air Force One Low Type in the melon tint. I wonder if it looks like an Air Force One, but it is. Yeah. I wonder it's if a bit crazy the tongue. Anthony like Fantano has anything to do with this? Looks like a bloody um. Oh yeah. Looks like a bloody golf ball. It does look like a golf ball. It's quite there. quilted. What does that say? N354 or Nest? No. No, that's definitely 35, but I think that's a T. No, I like a... Looks like maybe a cross. Number 35? Number 35 plus. Maybe. I don't know. Wait, we can't look at what's going on with that strap. That looks like a bit like a golf bat. It does a bit, yeah. Like the ha the grippy handle bit. <laughs> yeah. That looks like it's Velcro, but I don't understand what that would do. For show, sure, mate. I suppose so. It's got no zipper, though, so it's a, it's a down vote. It's a down vote for you. All right, then. There you go. <laughs> so these ones are releasing Wednesday, which is the first for 140 A standard Air Force price. Now we've got the Nike Zoom Spyrodon Cage 2. Sounds very Gladiator-esque. You remember that TV show? Gladiators. Yeah. Gladiator, yeah. That shit was good. <laughs> I, I really liked that. that. Back in the day, yeah. They had like those, like sticks with the foam on the end. They yeah. Whack each other with it. Whack each other off. <laughs> what was some of their names? Lion. Well, I don't remember Lion. I just made it up. 
Probably it was, though. <laughs> Zeus has got to be in there. Oh, I think Zeus was one. They had very, like, brute names. Brute might have even been one. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> We're talking about uh, minty toothpaste. They're looking pretty... That's not bad, that one. I yeah, I don't mind it. My favourite would bit would definitely have to be, like, the perforated, like, leather all around it. Yeah. I'm just not a fan of these laces. Like, they're on the 97s and 95s. I don't hate those laces. It's got the little gap. Yeah, the end up there. Oh, yeah, I just noticed that. It'd be easier to scratch your ankle. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that goes quite low as well. I don't hate them. I don't like yeah. the colour, but... Yeah, I think the silhouette is... Has something. Yeah, it's onto something. It could be it. Yeah, it's close. It's close. It's not I bad. like, I like the, the X. X. That's quite a uh, innovative. Quite cutting edge. Yeah, innovative. It's very, very gritty. Subtle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They're not too bad. I, I do agree with you though. The color is its biggest downfall. But these ones only cost 130, so even less than the Air Force ones, and they are also releasing on Wednesday. We've got some more Adidas on the night ball. We did have a look at this uh, a couple of weeks ago. I've got some new oh, colours. Yeah. I don't like most of the shoe. It looks kind of like a Wave Runner. It does look like a Wave Runner. But I do like that up there. It'd be cool if it did something. Like you push it and it just like ordered pizza or something. Pizza time. <laughs> I don't like this bit here. It's too shiny. I don't like shiny surfaces on shoes. I don't think that should be a thing. Right. That looks like a, um, like steps. Oh, yeah. I definitely prefer the other colourway. Oh, those jeans are horrible. <laughs> I think the rubber. choice of jeans there just shows their, uh, tw their target audience. Right, oh, there you go. Boom. Got him. Uh, I'm not a fan. You're roasted. I don't like that. Got the three stripes on the bottom. I do. Even that colour of jeans is horrible. <laughs> I like this nah. one better too. You like this one? Yeah. I like this one. You like that one? Yeah. I don't know why. I do like both of the, the colours, but this one just a bit more. But that, that silhouette, I don't like one bit. What do you think of the silhouette? Nah, it's alright. We haven't seen the right colour yet, mm. I don't think. Maybe but eventually. I think that's good, something. yeah. But they are releasing Wednesday for 120. Even less again. There you go. They've got the Nike Zoom double stack. I don't like the sound of this. <laughs> it's releasing on Thursday for 230. Oh lord. Twice the air bubble. I wonder if that would be more comfortable or less comfortable. Looks like a high heel. God, no. It does. That's adding at least three inches. And what's with Nike and, like doing this bit recently? No. Like, the shoe's meant to end here. It's adding, like, an extra metre onto the back of it. <laughs> That's a no from me. <laughs> I do want to know if they'd be more comfortable or less comfortable, though. Have to buy oh, some. that's quite horrible. <laughs> Go Is up. that hollow? Like, could I... Hook my finger in there and like nah. jerk someone's foot back. <laughs> you could jerk something. <laughs> it is. Nah, that's a different part. Nah, you can't get in there. Nah, I, I think you can. Nah, 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 nah. nah. Oh, that's horrible. <laughs> nah, that's quite especially for two hundred and thirty. That's quite bad. Maybe you can keep your money in there. I give it a four now. It was a two. <laughs> Maybe you can put your money in that gap. I think what you're saying with um, like the air rift, those sandal looking things. If you wear those, people know it's a joke. Yeah. But if you wear these, people just think, "Oh, that shit." <laughs> yeah. No, I like the sandals. <laughs> Did you end up copping a pair? <laughs> oh nah. <laughs> we have to get one resale. We'll wait for the next round of. I think you'd probably save money going resale. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Uh, next up, we've got the Nike Air Zoom Division. We've got a lot of Zooms releasing. Oh. 
I think the the division is still like the D slash I slash ten. Oh yeah. I think it's still with them, but they look shitter. So I, I believe there's two. Why is there a line there? That's not on all the pictures. Just that one. That's quite they poor. Just wanted that. I, and I've still got the weird the underbite. Happen over there. That's what <laughs> the I'm calling it. The underbite. Oh, it does sort of look like a face there with that circle thing <laughs> yeah. and then it's got the mouth. Looks like it's got a real big chin. <laughs> the crimson chin. <laughs> I believe there's two colour... Oh, I don't like that. That reminds me of the, um... The vault yellow, whatever yeah. it's called. Oh, I heard that. Oh, I can't even remember what they're called. I think there's three colours to this one. The old white just look like the dad shoes. <laughs> that's just a standard shoe. That's nothing. That's literally nothing special. <laughs> so it's got the overbite. Underbite. Yeah, that, I hate it. Like, it looks horrible. I'm still trying to think of that shoe. These ones aren't bad, but still that back just ruins it. Um, does how much these cost? Oh, we don't know. So there you go. But they're releasing on Thursday, which is the second. Now we've got the Nike Air Zoom Alpha Fly Next Percent. Don't like this. Oh, watermelon. <laughs> In the watermelon colorway. Oh, I like watermelon colorways. And this I'm one, you, you do. It's releasing Thursday for 250 Right, oh, I don't like that one. If it's, where's the green? On the bottom there. It's looking a lot more green on that screen. It's more of a cream. In, oh, that's quite horrible. And that looks like it's already creased to shit. It's not the best. Atom knit. The, I'm trying to find these shoes. Okay, it's got blue on the other side. That's not watermelon. Acronym? Could be, but it's not the ones you're thinking of. I yeah, think the Vapor Max. Yeah. I know what you mean. Yeah, but like in that colorway. Yeah. Yeah, I know what you're talking about now. There we go. I thought it was Vapor Max. <laughs> Uh, the back of these from the top look horrible. Oh lord! Got like the, like the shark bloody... fin going. Yeah. Oh yeah. No, I'm not. Nike needs to just end the shoes at the end of the shoe. That looks pretty hectic. It looks high oh. quality, but it does look very high quality. Not my style. Yeah, I do like it. Um, like the top half there, like the laces and the the mouth of the shoe, mm. are quite nice. But uh, yeah, these ones will cost two hundred and fifty, which I think is fairly reasonable for how they look. And then we've got them in another color, the lime oh blast. Lord, no, leave it. <laughs> very bulbous. I don't understand what they're going for there. The top of the shoe is looking very sleek. Bulbous all. And then the <laughs> the bottom of it is looking quite chunky. Yeah. Very heavy. Funky and chunky. Chunky <laughs> and funky. It is quite chunky and funky. I'm not really a fan of them. I wouldn't pay 250 for them, that's for sure. And we've got a collab with Pharrell Williams on the Superstar. Oh, Lord. Wait, Pharrell Williams... Oh yeah, he's with um, Adidas. Mm. I'm assuming the back there would say human ra human race. Yeah. I think uh, human made is his brand. I like how the shell toe is made of knit. Maybe it says take a the race. It could say that. I mean, <laughs> he's got to do that there. <laughs> For the culture. I'm not sure how I feel about the shoe. I definitely don't like the yellow. Oh, that's made it a whole lot worse. Yeah, human race. I don't know. It's like innovative, I suppose. Mm. It's different. Colon again. I like when it's when he puts colon right there because it's just funny. I understand he's got like the all of the human inside bits, but he's got to put colon and pelvis. Right where you're looking. I'm just sad he doesn't have, like, dick or anything. <laughs> what would you do if you're walking past someone's shoe? Right. Like, that's just like, I don't know, you come over to someone's house, you look down, it just says pelvis and colon in it. I'd laugh. That'd make me laugh. 
What does that say? Adidas. Oh, it's yeah, yeah. It's not bad. The front of it looks like it's very rough. <laughs> that looks like um, the Kanye, like the 350s. Yeah. I don't like... I like the other color way better. Oh, maybe not. Maybe. I don't know. I'm not sure how I feel about either of them. It's not the greatest. Yeah. Uh, I think it's a miss for me. But maybe in different colours it will look a lot better. But uh, they're fairly reasonably priced for a Pharrell collab at 140 And they are releasing this Friday, which is the third. And we've got a Nike, probably another Zoom. Yep, the ACG Air Zoom AO. Does this have the um, pocket? I don't think so. It's not the worst one we've seen. Oh, I like the little tie-off hole. Yeah. Maybe you can put something in there. I think out of all the zooms we've seen, it is the best. Did it say amphibious? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. ACG amphibious. I'm assuming they're waterproof. That's pretty sick. I'm all, I'm here for the ACGs. The only thing they're missing is the old... Um, the money pocket. Yeah, wait, what's it say on the bottom? It says something. ACG is designed and tested. In Oregon, USA. Oh, yeah. Does it just keep saying that? No, it's just like the bloody... Um, it just keeps going. Made on Earth. I like that. The Nike name and swoosh stripe and ACG <laughs> triangle are your guarantee of quality. I do like the Made on Earth, but I, I think legally they do have to specify somewhere else where they are actually made <laughs> I don't think you can be that broad with it and we've got a Jonah Hill collab with the Adidas Superstar now he's a, uh, I don't know if you know this but he's quite evolved with the culture he's a massive fan of 90s hip hop and fashion yeah. um, I don't know what the movie is either but he directed a movie about like 90s hip hop mm, I do remember that yeah I don't know what I it's called and I, I haven't watched it but I, I do want to but it, it does look very 90s, like very, um... Oh, oh what's the... Oh. There's a group of guys. Fuck, what are they called? The Wu-Tang Clan. That's not what I'm thinking of, but they are quite Wu-Tang Clan-esque. Salt and Pepper. <laughs> <laughs> Salt and Pepper is what I'm thinking of. MC oh, Run DMC. Run DMC, that's exactly what I'm thinking. It looks very Run DMC. <laughs> As if it's not Salt and Pepper. <laughs> That's disrespectful <laughs> to the goats. I do like how that's quite like sort of graffiti like. It's not bad. But yeah, they're very uh, chunky, which is it's sort of true brand, to so yeah for nineties. <laughs> no, he slimmed down actually. Nah, well, I feel like he got he got back up again. No shaming him. Is, is Jonah Hill fat dot com? He's Jonah Rogan. <laughs> <laughs> I thought he... I knew he got skinny again. But I thought I saw him in the protests in America and he was a bit bigger. But okay. apparently he's Jonah Rogan right now. So. <laughs> I don't that. That's quite clever. And we've got a few Yeezys that are quite a while ahead right. this is the 380 in blue oat <laughs> <laughs> looks like a dinosaur egg <laughs> it does look like a dinosaur egg actually so these ones are releasing quite a while away uh, the 25th of July which falls on a Saturday it's about a month away it is about a month away yeah uh, for the standard price of 230 I think that yeah that's the only picture we've got and we've got another 380 silhouette uh, the laminate this is releasing in December, also for about 380 But it looks to be just like the reverse of that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Weird. I know, I'm not a fan of the 380s to begin with. They're not the best shoe that he's coming out with. No. The Croc is the best, I reckon. The Yeezy slides. <laughs> mm. Looks like a bone. Like that. The Yeezy it looks like a skeletal bone. It does look your quite a, quite bony. <laughs> yeah. It's like a skeleton that you wear on your foot. 
Uh, yeah, it is a, a very sort of skeletal outer. Yeah. Exoskeleton. Yes. <laughs> all right, well. That's all we've got for the shoes. For the shoes. Be sure to tune in later for a track review. Yes. I don't know what I'm bringing yet, actually. I'll have to check Spotify's release radar. Oh, shit. Do they tailor that to your listens? No idea. Literally have no idea. Because I haven't subscribed to anything. I don't know how they would recommend me stuff. Anyway, you're going to want to see that, so be sure to tune in tonight. That's a wrap.